I think big. I really, whatever it is, I, I don't think very small. I've had people say, you know, why do these children deserve a leg up? You can't blame a young child for something they're a grown adult their parent decided to do. During Yasmin's time as a young scholar, I know that she has endured a lot. Life has sort of forced me to be mature. My father was in and out of prison a lot when I was growing up, so I really didn't have that relationship with him. Sometimes life happens. It's a reality, it's not a nice reality, but that's okay. That doesn't have to determine your future. She has such big faith and because of that, because of the love of her grandmother and her family, I think that she's been able to really persevere with good humor and always seeing her glass as half full as opposed to half empty. I love grandma. Grandma is great. After my mom passed away, I saw another side of her that I've never seen before. She was just so strong and I was like, oh my God. Without her, a lot of the scholarships I have now, I would not have. I feel like I'm sitting in a dream. It says that people respect the work I do and that they see the potential of this organization and, and of me, and that means a lot. I see it ultimately as an international thing. If we can get more young people who have obstacles to say, you know what, I'm still gonna go to school, it would kind of help to reverse the cycles of poverty and, and misfortune. Looking at these young people, looking at my life, it's possible, I'm, I'm not doubting that at all.